Yes, we are back. We are back. And uh, if you're just joining us, you are on time for the first conversation of the day. We start with sports on tech. But meanwhile, the hashtag to use today, if you want to interact with us, it's Thursday Vibes. And you can go on our social media handles at Y254. So today on Sport on Tech, we are talking about a crypto battery app innovation uh, by differential systems. But we have a... Uh, we have a representative, Eric Kinuthia, who's the lead crypto analyst and the software engineer of this particular company. Karibu sana, Eric. Thank you so much. Glad to have you with us. I'm glad to be here too. So we want to know about uh, this particular innovation, you know, to Najwa bursaries and how, you know, how we go to, you know, how people go to apply for bursaries and then take some time and uh, for review. So you've come into this space yeah. to uh, solve a problem or something you'll be telling us about. So tell us about the crypto uh, bursary app. Yeah, uh, thank you so much. Uh, crypto bursary app is basically a software that uh, issues uh, uh, bursary checks and uh, bursaries to applicants. Mm -hmm. uh, mostly uh, bursaries, they, uh, they, they tend to be uh, issued kwa constituency, kwa constituency level and uh, the county levels. And uh, I think that is uh, the, the, base, the basis of uh, our, our operation. Our, yeah. So mm -hmm. the software basically works by you input the data from the applicants so we we go to the constituencies that have the have purchased the software mm -hmm. then uh, after that we 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 input the, them to the system the system automatically does everything and issues uh, the bursaries uh, prints check checks and uh, it uh, sorts of li limits people from uh, stealing the stealing that we uh -huh. Okay, so happens, I want yeah. to, to get to understand this. So people come to apply for bursaries in the... Uh, are you working now with the constituencies at yeah, this time? Yeah, 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 currently, okay. yeah. So when someone goes to the office, the CDF office, to yeah. apply for a bursary, they fill a form yeah. and uh, they wait uh, to be given to, to know how their, how their status, yeah. how they stand, if they're going to get it or not. And now you've come to, um, you are now in the backlog operation of it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So basically now you take the form and then you input the data. Yeah. The system. Okay, what happens? Mm -hmm. If you, you fill in the form, it gets uh, to a process that is called the approval stage. Now it is vetted by the, it is checked by the chiefs, it is checked by the probably the pastors, the school heads, they have to uh, establish that you are, uh, you are, whatever you filled in the form, it's what is actually is. And uh, so, uh, But during the application in the form, I think uh, there's usually a place for the chief to sign. Yeah, yeah. That? actually that is what happens. Mm -hmm. So after all that process is done, mm -hmm. uh, that's when now we feed in the system, we feed the data into the system. Once we feed the data, now the system does the other, the, the rest. It issues, uh, it allocates, uh, and uh, it allocates the bursaries mm -hmm. as it's supposed to be. You know, uh, there's a tendency in the constituency. I, I believe you you've been a, a victim. Everyone has been a victim. <laughs> so, <laughs> okay. Uh, she to not applying the bursaries, but. Uh, not sometimes everyone gets it. not everyone gets and some sometimes those who get are not the people who are supposed to get mm -hmm. probably mko, mko well off uh -huh. then uh, the people who deserve to get it don't yeah, they get don't it. yeah 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 all right so, so the system mm -hmm. in atoa is all is all issues it checks for uh, duplicacy you know with the manual one mm -hmm. you know it's easy to give to issue someone like two times unampea bursary like three times. Ah. So his system in Angalia duplicates to ensure that it's uh, everything is fair. Okay. Yeah, so yeah. how is it better from the old system, the manual system, apart from the, you know, the problem that it's solving on corruption, eliminating yeah. corruption? Yeah. What else is it coming to help with? Now the time, uh, the, 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 the time of uh, issuing. So mm -hmm. initially it used to, the manual one used to go like for like two, three months. 
So we apply January to Pewa, April, ama probably May. And why, why, why was that happening? Uh, it, basically now the, the, the slow process, you have to approve, now again you have to vet, again you have to, you, you are doing it manually, you take now the names. So the committee was the, was the one who, who are, you know, checking the names to and yeah, if yeah. you qualify or if you don't. Yeah, mm -hmm. so you see like you, the, the, that process t is tedious, considering sometimes you'll have like uh, 40,000 applications depending on the constituency. Mm -hmm. So sometimes you can even get to 100,000 applicants. So uh, you can imagine the process behind uh, mm -hmm. the manual one. Okay. So right now it only takes like a week. Okay. And uh, the, only a week and everyone is sorted. Quite, a, quite effective. You yeah, know, a week so effective. is a very short time for you yeah. to get a bursary compared to what we're used to. Yeah. And now, um, what criteria does it use now? Because you know, some are in a, in a limit, the buses and mm -hmm. so what criteria does it use to disburse the bursaries? Okay, the first thing we check, uh, we first of all start with checking your status as a, an applicant. Mm -hmm. Probably you you have a disability or something uh, of the sort. Mm -hmm. Next, you go to check the parent status. Probably you are an orphan. So uh, they, they are classified with weights. Mm -hmm. no, weights okay. Yeah, we also check the income of your parents. Mm -hmm. it's, it also checks. Now the other thing is the performance because again, you, it's unfair to issue someone who is underperforming, uh, but uh, we tend to, it's, a, it's an added weight. So mm -hmm. not really the... You're the, not measuring on that. Yeah, yeah. But it's an added... An advantage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So it checks also on the performance, not the, also the type of uh, school, the, the category. Mm -hmm. So maybe you are in um, a boarding school, a day school. You can be in the, the, the TVETs. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it checks all, all, all of that. So, so for example, if you're in a boarding school, you get more then okay so the money is actually usually allocated a specific amount to those in the boarding school high school those in uh, the day school high school and then primary school and then universities a certain amount for everyone yeah yeah it talks the budget no mm -hmm. the constituency the C the cdf offices now mm -hmm. they determine the budget that they want to issue mm -hmm. so we work with the budget that is allocated so probably they want some amount of money to be dispersed to probably the day schools. Mm. The, uh, another batch of it is supposed to be dispersed to the universities and uh, so we work with the budget okay. to ensure everyone gets an equal uh, mm. amount. Yeah. All right. And how do you verify these details? Because you've said you use uh, the details. If one is an orphan, you know, depending on if one is more disadvantaged, then they at a, they stand a better chance of getting the bursary. So, how do you verify these details? Is it uh, the do you rely on the form that uh, the applicant has given? Not really. Okay, the first thing that you have to do mm -hmm. uh, it, the, the, it goes on, uh, on several agencies like the the the, the school first. Okay, uh, it's hard to corrupt from the school to the chief All the way. to yeah mm. it's hard so one thing if you the, the, by the time we are getting the forms mm -hmm. it is uh 90% approved now the issue the, uh, actually the major issue was now the committee mm. the committee initially now the committee you know the if you know someone then you are good the networks mm -hmm. the connections the <laughs> network so come <laughs> connected you ended up to get now sai hakuna committee co involved in mm -hmm. allocating anyone ama anything so basically it's the forms we feed it ourselves not the constituency we feed it ourselves uh, into the system but we are currently working on a, a virtual a, a, an online one mm -hmm. so where you can apply from any point that you are in Kenya so this is some one of the advancements that you're working on. Yeah, yeah. Uh, actually, it, uh, it is already done. We mm. only have to unveil it. All right, yeah, interesting. Yeah. So now you don't have to go to the office to queue and you know do fill the form and leave it there. So you can now apply online. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And uh, what what constituencies are you working with currently? Uh, we have uh, seven constituencies. I'll probably name one. Uh, we, we mostly we have been uh, we started it in Kandara constituency, mm -hmm. uh, yeah Kandara constituency. Okay. Now we we are, we are keeping on moving and uh, we are working on uh, probably we can get to Kiambu County. The, we are trying 
Okay, and the, how is the response from the, when you approach the, count, uh, the counties and constituencies? Now we're currently on constituencies only. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How is the response okay. when you approach them? Uh, the first time, you know, we are Kenyans. Mm -hmm. So, unajua ukienda pale, wanashanga... And, you know, you, you are getting to their loopholes. So, mm. probably you are kind of... Unless you get now the, the genuine people in the office, they are the people who try and you have to convince them. Mm. Una convince, una ambia. Iki tu ina, say, the at least itakuina reduce now the 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 the, the process. Mm. Pia unajua, pia yo committee wanalipangwa. Mm -hmm. So, like, you know... So, you, now, committee may lose job. Now that you do I, I just lose. <laughs> they must like battle vet whatever is happening. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we 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 are working with, so with the law. Just like coming me. to assist. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, make the process yeah. uh, more effective. Yeah. So okay. So uh, the response depends on the. No, the people you you. The people you, you interact get. with. Yeah. Do you go straight to the member of parliament? Yeah, you or? first of all you can you can go to the member of parliament mm -hmm. and uh, you there are people you call the funds managers mm -hmm. you can even get to them try to make them understand the 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 working of the software and uh okay we have a good uh, re they have been receiving it well mm -hmm. uh can't complain but unajua tu lazima kuna kuna issues behind so if the whole country has uh, adapt the system, mm -hmm. we can be good. So that's your vision. Yeah, yeah, yeah. To get to the national government. Amazing, and yeah. this is this is actually very nice, and you know we can see the transparency or the fairness in the process yeah. at least in our education system. And so, how did you come up with this innovation, you and your team, and who? Nani wako kwa team yako? Because we just uh, okay. Uh, the first guy I can mention is like uh, the technological father to me, mm -hmm. uh, it was Robert Kanyoro. He's the guy who actually came up with the idea for at first. Yeah, he's, he, he has been the vocal guy on the software, actually. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so for us, we came into the team, added ideas. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, mostly, we have been working the two of us. Oh, you and Kanyoro? Yeah, Kanyoro, yeah. Okay. He's the CEO of Differential Systems. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, and uh, when when did it was it birthed? Uh, around 2020, 2020, yeah. Twenty twenty, and it yeah. started its operation in. Uh, twenty twenty. Twenty twenty. Oh. Yeah, we had the we had the idea, but we you know, you keep on advancing. Now the COVID break, it mm -hmm. gave us time to like restructure the the whole system. Oh, yeah. Right. Initially, we we used to like assist. Mm. You when they they had the applicants now we used to feed them in an Excel sheet, mm -hmm. you know th that was a tedious work. You know you feed it to an Excel sheet. Now you have to determine who will get. Yes. now. now yeah. You're given uh, by the 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 the, the committee. You're, you're supposed to like now do the arithmetics mm. and uh, ensure that whatever you're given is what uh, will you're reflect. Feeling. Yeah. Okay. So what technology then? Uh, are you using behind the system? Uh, we, ha we have a, it's, it's a complex uh, algorithm. I can see it's an algorithm mm -hmm. uh, that uh, is working behind, uh, behind the system. Now the, uh, we, we, we tend, it's a trade secret. Oh, I, I, so I, I hope. I hear the talk. <laughs> I hear the talk. <laughs> okay, okay. Well, yeah, yeah. we'll keep it that way. So yeah, because, uh, uh, because I think we are the only guys who are doing the the bursary systems in Kenya currently. Ah, yeah, so, so it's actually an invention. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By you. Yeah. yeah well, that's very nice. So what what is it about uh, innovation and solving problems? So yeah, basically, first of all, you can start by saying uh, innovation is like uh, you coming up with a new idea mm -hmm. or improving an existing idea to make something uh, to be less tedious mm -hmm. or to be more advantageous when okay. you're doing it. So uh, that basically the you know, innovation, like you... The foundation of it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Find oh. a problem, uh, find a new means, or am you... And you get to learn these things with mm -hmm. time, um, with the challenges that you're facing. But uh, you have a background in uh, tech. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what are you studying? Uh, 
I was studying in campus, uh, JQuart. Mm -hmm. I was studying mathem mathematics and computer science, pure mathematics. Okay, so for yeah. someone to do any, any innovation or come up with an invention, is it necessary that you have such a background? Not really, not really. Mm. Uh, one thing I can say, uh, we, we have gotten into a point at, mm -hmm. uh, where everything lies in your phone. Mm -hmm. Google is the biggest invention that I can say. Yeah. Because mm -hmm. right now, with Google, you can search anything. You have resources online. And uh, mm -hmm. an example of uh, China, you, you know, China, they are the guys who are leading us in uh, probably the phones, whatever. Mm -hmm. You know, if we as a country can uh, adapt the system that China wa uses mm -hmm. in uh, innovating and stuff, I, th I think uh, we can be far much ahead. There's a database that contains like the processes of the biggest innovations mm -hmm. in the world. So like eh, China wana endanga wana wana some of you too. Come on your mobile phone. Eh, I'm sure mm -hmm. kuna mobile phones mingi sana say in the African market yeah. zina tokanga China. Mm -hmm. True. Uh, uh, our say wana wana you, you, you are free to, to use whatever it's being done, ama enye ilifanyika. You are free. Only that sasa u improve, ama ufanye, an improvement, it's your idea and it's your innovation. Uh -huh, to make you it can, better. Yeah, you can patent it. Sasa kama vile Apple inafanyanga, you, so you, you, the, you can go and make your own phone through the database, the information they gave to the database. Mm, yeah. Okay, interesting. So now do you have a patent on... Uh, this system yeah. that you have developed. Yeah. Okay, so no one can steal it. Uh, no one. Okay. So I'm going to talk to you about it. behind where it's okay, we yeah. still understand. So are you looking to make any further an advancements to it apart from the online um, incorporation that you have added to it? Yeah, we are keeping on uh, using, uh, now we are using the AI, we are using, uh, we, we are advancing in terms of the, the, the whatever we are using. So like now we, Okay, you don't have to stop where we, you started, mm -hmm. where you are. We have been uh, like using the AI to learn the data. So later on, it was so automatic, and uh, we are even integrating with blockchain, mm -hmm. where we use oracles and uh, some some uh, codes, small codes. They are called smart contracts. Mm -hmm. Where you basically need, if your conditions are met, we even don't have to rely on the no us to mm -hmm. feed anything ama to manipulate anything like kuangalia team msia mejaza ama anything when you apply the conditions are met you issued the, with the bursary i i think in future in future that is what will be happening all right interesting so you have incorporation of ai and blockchain technology yeah, yeah, to yeah. it do you want to speak a bit on blockchain technology for someone who doesn't understand how it works yeah yeah oh, okay blockchain the simplest now. way Blockchain, mm -hmm. uh, I can just say is the, the new technology. It's a it's an emerging technology now to us, but it has been there. Uh, it works with the, in terms of nodes and networks. Mm -hmm. So like uh, it's more it is more secure, and like the the system that we are having right now, and they, it uses tokens. Mm -hmm. Token. There, those are, those are things called tokens. But I think. That is the simplest but definition, <laughs> but it's an enjoyable uh, field. Uh -huh. It's a new field that is coming up. Mm -hmm. I think anyone and as a learn your kit to na economic market kubwa san. Okay, to talk with uh, some other time again, you come and speak on blockchain technology. Yeah. Are there, uh, as we come to a close on this, are there other systems that you have developed, you and your team, or you on your own? Yeah, we we have worked on a lot of systems, but uh, only to mention. Uh, like the uh, Okusikwa na opaqueness. Okay. We had a tiling system. Uh, uh, in in work uh, in the previous uh, general election uh, mm. that, that just concluded. So basically, for us, even we had the tally even before they got to the the constituency tallying centers and stuff. Mm. We like. Have a, we, you yeah, already knew the figures. We had the figures. Mm -hmm. We create systems. Uh, the, that is one. We have other management systems like school systems, mm -hmm. uh, where we we help the school to manage all workings. Now we even are working on uh, management 
if you have a project, you have a construction project, anything, mm -hmm. you can track your project. Now, if you can reach us out, we can give you the system. It's already done. Like, okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. So where can people, as we come to a close on this, where can people find you? But before you tell us where people can find you, mm -hmm. what's, what are you looking for? What is a vision for you and your team in future in terms of where you want to see uh, the technology landscape or in Kenya and where you want to see yourselves? Okay. Uh, I can start with the next five years. Mm -hmm. uh, we like want to get to every sector so we are after every sector mm -hmm. uh, right now so from the banking all the way to education to we we are after big sectors yeah and mm -hmm. uh in five years we, we just want to have uh gone to over 20 sectors amazing yeah. and where do you where do you see kenya is at in terms of innovation are we are we giving um, the youths more opportunities to be innovative? Is the government and uh, stakeholders giving room for people to be creative? Uh, first of all, uh, I have to start with critiquing the education system that we have. Mm -hmm. Where basically everyone, uh, with the system where we are trained to be employees. Mm -hmm. and not really to think about what we can do other than being employed. Yeah. Uh, I can tell you for a fact, I've never applied for any job. Mm -hmm. That's a job, kutaka time nilikuwa kampo. So what do skills zako? Ni skills, yeah, uh, uh, soft skills, they are the best thing. But mm -hmm. the government, in a, in, in a, in a playing a part, but we, we are really behind. So what is needed? Like the government needs to like bring up to a lot of research centers, mm -hmm. uh, more expos, you have expos. Now to train people also on uh, IP, in the intellectual properties, mm -hmm. like the, how to patent your things. Like, uh, I don't want to mention companies, but there are some companies who get to campuses, secondary schools or whatever. Now, if you have a big idea, they tend to take you away then they go they, they take, take your, idea. Your, innova your idea na inaenda ina patent you so by the time una talker your system is working when it's out. not under you it's not under you now mm -hmm. uh, the other thing is about you now the finances in Kenya by there I can tell you for a fact especially a place like Jaguar it's a lot of ideas innovations ziko mm huko -hmm. but now pitching now to the investors mm -hmm. I think th th that is an issue. It's a challenge. Yeah, and uh, I hope in future, mm -hmm. Kenya to Netherlands are could adapt like whatever uh, a, a system where we can be like pulling funds for innovations. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because currently you might have a big idea but less finances. Okay, and we, ha we have the potential. We have the potential. Actually, uh, Kenya is a leading uh, country in terms of technology in Africa. In Africa, yes. Yeah, so uh, adoption is really quick in Kenya, and we are smart guys. And not only in the US, we are seeing you in your tech. You are in Kenya. Yeah, from Kenya to Ko to Kopoa. To Kosawa. So we just yeah. need the support and the backing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of yeah. the system and the finances and all that. Yeah, and the education, bado ikwe more vocal like. Yeah, and the, at the lower levels of education, like mm. in the primary schools. So is yeah, it as idea? It as idea. <laughs> Let's hope so. Oh, awesome. Okay. Thank yeah. you very much for coming on. Well, tell Welcome. us where people can find you on social media when uh, they want to reach you. Uh, you can reach us out on our email at mm. differentialsystems.co.ke. Uh, you can, me, I'm not in, Siko uh, Facebook. Hi. Uh, what nah. <laughs> 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 Okay. I think uh, you can reach out to me on my number uh, mm. 0717 mm -hmm. 834080. And uh, the, the only guy, the one guy in Facebook, Moyana uh, could recommend is called Kanyoro Duku. Duku Kanyoro. Your partner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That guy is the person now you can reach to in case you want to reach him on Facebook. Okay. On Twitter to na fanyanga biashara ingine. That that now that is <laughs> now me. Now stories are mambo ya cryptocurrencies. 
That mm -hmm. is what now my Twitter is all about. Okay, you call biz yeah. you're in social media, like any business. Yeah. Now, well, now, mambo ya, oh, nini. Ufai kutumia. Social, <laughs> <laughs> social life uchini ya maji. Eh, waki ingiza kakitu upia unaingiza <laughs> at the end of the day. Okay, thank yeah. you very much, Eric, Welcome. for coming on board and sharing with us uh, your new innovation. And we definitely wish you the best as you explore the whole of Kenya and, uh, you know, add to uh, help the system in terms of uh, the bursaries. Yeah, yeah. Okay, thank, thank you, you very thank much. You. So that has been Eric Kinuthia, who's the lead crypto analyst and software engineer at Differentia Different differential system, a company that has come up with a crypto bursary app innovation. That is what all we have for you on Sport on Tech, but we are not done. Calum Eval is coming up for some great interviews on music and lifestyle, so you don't want to miss that. We take a short break. We'll be right back.